Hey everybody, it's Dan from The Fold. Welcome back to another episode of... That's right, it's the Weekly Whip where I, Dan from The Fold, hop on here for just a few minutes each week to discuss secrets and revelations from our past decade with LEGO Ninjago, as well as some tips, tricks, and some behind the scenes action from The Fold, and a whole lot of random nerdiness by yours truly. Oh no. Oh no, I feel it. I feel it coming. A really bad, really cheesy poem. Oh, I can't stop it! I can't stop it! Roses are red. Violets are too. Subscribe to our channel and turn that gray thumb blue. No, but for real, if you're just wandering on here, please subscribe to our channel. That's how we know you love us. That's how I know we'll be best friends forever. Also, my little nephew let me in on a little secret. Check out my nephew Mason on YouTube. Like and sub. If you ring that bell, you'll never miss an update. So even if you're subscribed, you still gotta click on that bell. Ring my bell, ring my bell. I'm sorry, I'm an 80s kid at heart. So you could be first. First? First comment. Yo, what's up, fold? First comment, just, let, just letting you know, cause I was first. So I say another episode, but you and I both know we've changed the title of this segment since last week. Very sneaky, the fold. Very sneaky. As I do, I name this segment in haste, and I'm sorry about that. But the moment I heard the weekly whip, I knew I had made a horrible mistake. How could you? Anyway, this week we're going to be digging way back to another season with a song we wrote called We Are Ninjago. First off, as these things cosmically line up, somebody sent me this amazing video montage featuring We Are Ninjago just yesterday. Roll it! We are Ninjago Everybody know We are Ninjago If you're part of the crew And believe that we do in your own way We are Ninja I always wanted to say that. Roll the film. Now before we get into the main event, which is a secret lost verse for We Are Ninjago that none of you have ever heard. Real quick, I want to start with a fan comment from YouTube. I like to do this because it draws you guys in. I do read the comments and it's a way for us to kind of have a conversation. You send us a comment, I respond the next week. This fan was asking about, uh, I posted a clip of season 12, which was the Arcadian Whip intro and they noticed that there were extra sound effects in there and some that were missing. I'm gonna play it again real quick right now, but um, she was actually right. So the version I played was not the final version. So it had an extra couple hey -oh, hey -oh, in there at the end, as well as I think some different sounds in the beginning. So good call, this is gonna happen from time to time. I'm pulling from files that are on my private computer. So very different from the polished uh, videos you're gonna see on YouTube from Lego. I gotta pause for a second to flash back to a YouTube comment that really affected me deeply. So right when this song, We Are Ninjago, first came out, a fan simply commented, is this slow rock? And I honestly did not know how to take that. I thought they meant, classic rock or worse yet dad rock Ooh, i was unaware of the genre only when master of mountain came out a few weeks ago did i put it together that this is a genre that is tied to coal so whether it's a real thing or not i still don't know but slow rock is cole's favorite kind of music so it wasn't really a compliment or a diss it was just more making light of the fact that Cole likes this strange kind of music. I stand corrected. I am no longer offended. So, yep, slow rock. We are Ninjago. Get your head out of your butt, Dan. You're four minutes in already. We wrote this song with our dear friend, Yepa Ritterbold. He's actually the man behind the curtain when it comes to Ninjago. 
If you haven't heard his name, you have now. He's the one who picked out Jay and Kramer to work on the orchestral music you hear in the show, and he was the one who chose us to do the theme song. So this is actually the first time we wrote a song with Yeppa in a room, alone, together, in Chicago. It was very exciting. Isn't that nice? Anyway, we kept the audio rolling the whole time. We like to do that when we're songwriting sometimes. You never know when you're gonna listen back and catch something that we would have missed otherwise, or we wanna listen back and hear, uh, oh, how do we go into that pre-chorus, or how do we get to that chorus? Sometimes when we're in the zone writing a song with a guitar, it comes out very smoothly, whereas it can feel forced in the studio. Let's listen to a quick outtake. Back in those days, it was called the Woo Crew theme. It's always so fun listening back to these things because you hear little glimmers of where you end up. We left that day from the session with Yeppo with lyrics that are very different from what you have in your song library today. So we wanted to actually share that version with you guys today. I'm gonna shove myself down in a corner and we'll check out this long lost verse to this unreleased gem, We Are Ninjago. Recognize this part. From thinking of the weekend. We are in Jago. Everybody know we are in Jago. If it moves you like me, then you're free to go on in your own way. We are in Jago. This part, I believe, is pretty much intact. You tell me. Beautiful. So that's that. 
I wanted to close and share a bit of adorableness with you uh, that happened in my house last week. Some of you know I have two kiddos. Uh, my son Lucas had a sleepover with his cousin Mason. This is Mason. Hey guys, it's Mason Hayes here. And make sure to go on YouTube and search up Mason Hayes and subscribe to me. Make sure to like on all my videos and hit the bell so you never miss any videos from me. Ring that bell. He's insane. Search up Mason Hayes. So as you can tell, Mason is much better at this YouTube thing than I am. And all they wanted to do all night was make YouTubes. And uh, my son is actually no stranger to YouTube either. He doesn't have his own channel. I won't allow it. Uh, some of you are aware of our most popular video on this channel. It's called Codename Arcturus. And for some reason, I got the harebrained idea to replace Kai's voice in that video with my son's three-year-old voice at the time, and he says, Oh, no! Here it is. Oh, no! I don't know if that helped the uh, successfulness of the video, maybe. Well, anyway, here's the result of my son and his best friend, Mason. I'm gonna let them spin us out, and uh, be sure be sure to like and sub and, and ring, ring that bell and and uh, also uh, make sure that you find me and search up and may ring that bell. Ring that bell. See you guys next week.